Hey guys, it's Max here from Fireside Bears, and today we're going to be looking at a film breakdown of Sam Mustafer. We're going to be looking exclusively at Week 10 against the Detroit Lions. This is the game that Sam Mustafer won his starting position. But within these clips, you're going to see a high football IQ, his great athleticism, his ability to consistently block, his ability to consistently snap, and oh my gosh, a good center who can block downfield? Yeah, we need to hold on to him as long as we can. Now, Sam's not perfect, no offense alignment is, but his main areas of improvement and concern are his strength and his pass blocking footwork. He gets thrown around, he's a much better run blocker, but under Nagy's new scheme with a quarterback like Justin Fields, in order to have a successful passing game, Sam Mustafer is going to need to improve upon his ability to pick up blitzers and much quicker defensive tackles. Outside of that, there's honestly not a lot to see in this tape that I personally take offense with. So without further ado, let's hop into the clips, shall we? Let's start off with his athleticism. As a center facing 4-3 defenses, he's going to be asked to do this a lot block the linebacker he does it he gets up there it's not a great block but guess what the linebacker doesn't make the play here talk about consistency look at this chip block here now we can't say for certain that he caused this touchdown but again he's doing his job the linebacker was removed from the play that's what a good offensive lineman is supposed to do here's where the strength comes into question he's pushed pretty far back almost into montgomery but his athleticism his footwork his ability to keep his body leveraged keeps the play going also shout out alex bars with that great bear hug this is what I love about Sam Mustafer. He knows he's not as strong as the tackle, but he's not going to get outworked here. It's two-minute drill. He keeps going. Goes from a double team to a single team. Guess what? That's not his play. Alex Barr has stopped blocking. This gets me giddy uh, just because he mauls two people. So this is a design double team. You're trying to push off, but guess what? They bring blitzers, and he says, no, I'll take both of you on. And then he hops into the pile because he thinks the ball's out. You can't teach this stuff pure effort here's that weakness strength d tackle moves into the two into the one tech and he just can't keep up he gets thrown to the ground here takes away a handful of yards this is something he can work on he can get a lot stronger and i hope that he does all in all there we have it that is a film breakdown week 10 of san mustafer just some good plays some bad plays uh next time you watch a bears game i know it's hard to keep an eye on the center but definitely do i think he has a lot of potential i think his footwork in the run game is fantastic i think the way that he leverages his body is fantastic his hands are always close to his chest uh, i think there's a lot to like here of course there are areas for improvement but fortunately there are things that can be fixed you can get stronger you can work on your footwork but you can't teach that kind of let me engage in contact let me like to hit people let me jump into the middle of the pile and get my nose in there those are the intangibles that he has so we as bears fans should be excited and happy that we pulled him from a practice squad into a starting position because he has nowhere to go right now but up